guys, welcome to another series of Copper Mine at Home. This is Lacrosse Edition. Today we will be covering three topics, stick work, defensive footwork, and offensive footwork. Our first topic is stick work. With a quick stick, you're focusing on not cradling, giving with your knees, giving with the head of your stick, and being as light with the ball as possible. You want to try to get as many touches in as possible when you're doing this. To progress this skill, you can go non-dominant or you can go with the back of your stick. To progress your quick stick routine, we have the reverse throw with a dominant side cap. Make sure you cradle the ball completely to your non-dominant shoulder, your knuckles are facing your partner, and you give a push-pull motion or a snap. As you catch, you're catching on your dominant side with the stick between your shoulders, and you continue this quick stick routine with your partner or a wall. As you've seen, we've been doing these progressions with partners. No fear, you can also do them with a wall or you can do them with a rebounder. Some things you can do is the dominant hand, the non-dominant hand, off stick, behind the back, one-handed, around the world, twizzler, and much more. You make your own routine and put a little music to it and you're good to go. In our second topic, we're going to be covering footwork. Here we have Coach Audrey setting up a 5x5 five five box in order to do some footwork around it. She's going to start at the first cone and sprint up to the second, staying low, shuffling around into the third cone, making sure her feet are not clicking or touching or crossing. When she hits the third cone, she'll begin to back pedal, making sure her head is up and facing forward. These are bent and she's not looking back to the cone behind her. Once she hits that third cone, she is then shuffling again to the first. Throughout this whole time, she is staying low, her knees are bent, and she is not popping up. You also will notice here that her stick is upright, not at a horizontal, but ready for defense or to catch a ball. Once you go through that a few times, you can then go the opposite direction. In this next drill, we are working on A, B, C, D defense. That stands for approach, breakdown, contact, and direct. The defender has their stick up as we approach, taking away the lane and their strong hand. As we break down our steps, we're making small steps with a drop step. We contact at the hip and we drive that attacker out with our feet and our legs. This defense can be used at the 8 meter, the 12 meter, as our attacker receives the ball, or this will be used in the midfield transition, transition to slow that attacker down. This next drill, we have Coach Emily doing the challenge and the redodge. As Coach Emily approaches, the defender is in good position. They stop her. She is going to pull back out into a shuffle, and as soon as they are relaxed, she is going to redodge them and use any dodge that she wants. She has a split dodge, a rocker dodge, or a roll dodge to get past them. Once passed, you want to get back onto your straight line to seal that defender ball. Thanks for tuning in to our Copper Mine at Home Lacrosse Series video. Feel free to check us out on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. This is Coach Audrey. Coach Emily and Coach Deanna signing off. Keep up the hard work.